um, about two minutes from the chain man's house. We're going uh, digging the dirt today. I'll explain more about that later. Why we're going digging in the dirt. We're going to an old home site. Uh, I hunted it 2009 a couple of times. We found some old silver coins there, but we haven't been back to it since then. Until today. See you later. Well, we're in the back of the house now. There's an old abandoned car there and a abandoned car here. These fields right here, you can see they're grown up. This is where the farmer found six cannonballs when he was farming. But you can't get in there, it's too thick. Danny's over there to the right a little bit. There's two abandoned tractors right there, old Fords. I got a target right here, the first target that I liked it. I think it's 1333 or 1344, stand by a second. 1232. Stand by, let's see what that is. Come on, you turkey. Shut off. Oh, I hate it when you do that. Mmm, 12.32, El Crapo. Well, we got the first corn. Oh, wait a minute. Might be a shotgun shell. Jesus, I thought it was a coin. Another shotgun shell. Never mind. Never mind. What you look at this magnolia tree? The size of it. Gigantic. Stand by. Finally, a coin. At the size of a penny. See if I can see Lincoln's face. Stand by a minute. If I can get this damn thing to shut off, that is. I can't make it out. I gotta go to the truck anyway, take some clothes off. I'm way too, got too many clothes on. Stand by. Second corner of the day, looks like another penny. But it's so dirty, I can't tell anything on it. Stand by. Jane man's hollering. You got something over here. We have to go see what it is. I just dug a nice button. But the guy wants us to leave. He's going to run his dogs in a few minutes. He got three dogs. He's afraid they'll bite us. He don't own the property. He just rents it from a friend of mine. I'll show you that button as soon as I stop. What are you doing over here, Jay man? So he just found a bunch of quarters in one spot here. Fifteen quarters so far. How many? Fifteen. No kidding. Hey, I just got two out of this hole. <laughs> you know what? And two somebody, somebody probably had a farm stand here at one time with, with people dropping change and stuff. Or like I said, people leaving change for the postman when they had to pay for postage. And they're, they're usually in the clump I'm digging up. I don't know if there's The guy wants us to leave. He's going to run his dogs in a minute. We got to make a move. Okay. So now, now that you're on to something good. That's all you, that's all you see. Denny and uh, John both dug it. Some cool old spoons. I found this too. This is some kind of thing with like leather. I don't know if it's old. <coughs> I got a couple flat coins. Yeah, no telling what that is. And that, that's Denny spoon. So that's a that's a pin that sheared that's a cool, off. This, this is a nice spoon. Yeah, it's a heavy duty brass. This baby's spoon. got some decorative design on it right yeah. here. That's some kind of farm thing, I bet you. Something. Solid brass. 
Yeah, that was be some kind of probably a pin that sheared off. This has got a design on the handle on the handle too. I just can't. It's all dirty. You gotta clean it. Yeah. Looks like a silver spoon. Or what? Well, plated. <laughs> plated, maybe. It's hard to tell. It's copper. It's brass. You can see, you can see brass, yeah, yeah. yeah. Cat brought copper. Yeah. Spoons. Well, we're at the button patch. Another year's growth. I don't even think we can even hunt in here. It's so bad. I gotta go back 300, 400 feet. Mm, mm, mm. Great balls of fire. I don't even know where to go in at. Stand by, we'll see how it goes so we can find us an entrance way in here. Shut off. Shut off, you junker, you. Well, we moved back a little bit into the wooded area. Well, it's not too bad. This is what this place where we which looked at used to be just like this. You could hunt it easy. But since it's been cut down and grown back up, this is the first time I've been here this year, you can't hunt the patch anymore. I got a 1216 here. More than likely a shotgun shell. Stand by. Looks like an old high brasser. <laughs> I dug a cool 300. The first two years I hunted in here. 1229. What the hell do you think that's going to be? 1229. I think a shotgun shell. It don't have to be. Stand by. Feels like lead. Probably is old bullet or something. Dirt roundup. Shotgun shells ruled. I got a, <clears throat> I think it's a 41. And an 18 weedy. Key, another key. Some kind of little hand wheel neural looking doodad thing. I had a nice button, but I can't get it to clean up at all, so I made it probably worse than it was. It was nice and gold gilted on the back. And all the gold gilt is gone. If you're gonna be dumb, you gotta be tough, I guess piece of lead. Now this bullet, it looks like a little pistol bullet, but it's got this metal ring around it, you see it? Maybe that's part of the shell and it went away, but if you pull on it, the metal piece will come off. So you end up with a round piece and a bullet. You got me? I don't know. I got that big super duper, maybe super duper knife gig tomorrow. And then again Wednesday at the same place, that big sandwich shop. We'll see how that goes. Stand by. Now, Daddy found some good stuff. Some spoons. Beaver. They'll be at the end. See ya. Surf church in the dirt. <clears throat> I 
My buddy says he wants a snack. Look at him. Mmm. <laughs> Give me a snack, Daddy. Give me a snack. What's the cat man do? You're getting better. Look at him eyes. Oh, baby.